So, you've got a taste for adventure too, huh? I must say, the patrons have been in a bit of a buzz lately. Though the topic on everyone's lips is more of an urban legend than actual news. Even minding my own business, I still end up hearing all about it. Uh-oh. It's not one of those scary urban legends, is it? If so, Paimon needs to take a deep breath first. <laughs> it's not a particularly scary story, no. At least, not for most people. It's the tale of... The Dark Knight Hero. Even listening? Anyway, the Dark Knight hero. It is said that he appears in the middle of the night to fight evil and uphold justice. But to be honest, I don't have much interest in such rumors. <laughs> Unless, of course, he can help take care of the more belligerent patrons after they've had a few too many. <laughs> I would happily take that as proof of his existence. I doubt anyone knows but him. Maybe he enjoys being a man of mystery. After all, it's a good way to get the ladies' attention. Any guy in the tavern could tell you that. <laughs> anyway, that's more or less everything I know. If you want to know more, ask around in the plaza. Oh, I need to serve some customers. Night Hero. Seems like your standard cookie-cutter urban legend. But just a little darker. Wonder who it could be. Once you're ready, let's head out to the plaza and ask around. Veggie soup. 
You want to find out about the Dark Knight hero? Look no further. It's me! I am the Dark Knight hero. <laughs> You're right, I'm not. I was joking. <laughs> Jokes aside, I do think that the Dark Knight hero and I have one thing in common. What's that? It's the way he sticks to his principles. Coming out here, night after night, fighting for justice, keeping Mondstadt safe. Wow, so you're a nocturnal vigilante too? <laughs> no. I just mean, he must be seriously rich. Why is that? People only start worrying about spiritual fulfillment once they have enough material wealth. It's the same in every hero story, isn't it? <laughs> no, it's nothing like that. I just have too much time on my hands these days. Same difference. You are the boss of the cat's tail, after all. Why don't you ask the guards at the city gate? They do night shifts all the time. They must know something. Home oh, fountain. <coughs> Here are my wishes. And a radish veggie soup. you heard? There's a strange wanderer near Wolfenham. Fresh fruit, only at Quinn's fruit. You want to know about him? In fact, I'm one of the few who has seen him with my own two eyes. Great! This is the guy we need to talk to! So, just who is the Dark Knight hero? Whoa! Slow, slow down. Let me start from the beginning. Well, I was patrolling one night when suddenly I heard something. I rushed over to check it out. I saw a gang of suspicious looking fellows who looked like they were up to no good. So I quickly hid. Hid? You're supposed to be a guard! That was when he appeared. He was dressed in black from head to toe, perfectly hidden in the night. The way he crept up on those bad guys, must have felt like a living nightmare. Wow! Guess what I did next? I wasn't the bad guy, why would I need to run away? Still, I did leave the scene. I didn't want to be a nuisance to the Dark Knight hero. So instead, I headed to the Knights of Favonius's residence. Correct. I thought surely someone with such a strong sense of justice and who voluntarily protects Mondstadt is exactly the kind of person you'd find in the Knights of Favonius. <sighs> but it seems I was wrong. I checked everywhere, and there were no signs of anyone having left the building. So you're saying whoever it is can't be from the Knights of Favonius after all? Yes. <sighs> but I... Just can't understand. Why would someone like that not want to join the Knights? I'm sure they would warmly welcome someone of his abilities. So, the point you're trying.
trying to make is, you don't know who the Dark Knight hero is either? Hey, don't be like that. At least by talking to me, you've ruled out a few more people. Anyway, try asking at the flower shop. I heard a girl there's been talking about the time you rescued her. Monstat welcomes you. Expedition at the Adventurers Guild. Come take a look. There will definitely be something that catches your eye.
It's getting dark. Let's stick around Monsta. Maybe if we're lucky, we'll Haven't meet the Dark Knight hero. There's a strange wanderer near Wolfendom. After managing to steer clear of the guard's patrol route, I never anticipated I'd run into you instead. Dark Knight Hero? Sounds awfully derivative to me. Please tell me you didn't come up with that. How is this the first you've heard of the name? Every man and his dog in Mondstadt is yapping about the Dark Knight Hero. I do not concern myself with idle chatter. Though, I suppose I may take the idleness of others as a sign that peace prevails. Huzzah! The great mystery of the Dark Knight Hero of Mondstadt! We solved it! Now then, Mr. Dark Knight Hero! Please, stop calling me that. Seriously, it makes me uncomfortable. Not surprised. It's the stupidest superhero named Paimon's ever heard. You should come up with something more original. Like... Um... Captain... Pi... Pi? Captain Pyro! Tell us, Captain Pyro, what happened here today? It was the Abyss Order. Them again? I don't know what the devil they're plotting this time. It seems they're performing some initial reconnaissance. Considering that I've proven myself to be one step ahead of them on countless occasions, their persistence is... unusual. I assume so. Unless you're aware of any other... Dark Knight heroes around these parts. The Knights are, for the most part, an utterly incompetent bunch. I cannot trust them to take this matter over. What's past is past. I would prefer not to discuss it. Well, I hope this conversation has been of service to you. Because I would like to ask for a favor in return. Oh? What is it, Master Diluc? Your wish is our command! You must keep my identity a secret. Above all, it is crucial that you do not let the Knights of Favonius know I am connected to any of this. <gasps> What's that sound? Yikes! Have the Abyss Order sent backup already? 
They appear to just be small timers. You should have no trouble dealing with them. I cannot afford delays on account of a few lackeys. I shall have to let you take care of them. Remember, don't tell a soul. Hey, you're just gonna leave us like this? Greetings. I thought I heard something, so I came to check it out. Did you see anything out of the ordinary? Nope. Nuh uh. Not here. Nothing. Silch! Unless you're looking for the Dark Knight hero, in which case. The Dark Knight hero? You saw him? Oh! Uh, the Dark Knight hero is. You! The hero who safeguards Mondstadt from the shadows! On behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I thank you for your service to this city. Uh, it's nothing. Really, you're too kind. W wait a second. Aren't you the traveler that just arrived in the city? Rumors were circulating about the Dark Knight hero long before you ever arrived here. Why would you lie to me about that? Mm, never mind. You don't seem like bad folks. But I do hope you will visit the Knights of Favonius soon, where we can discuss the Dark Knight hero situation in more detail. Some things are best not discussed in public. <sighs> Duty calls. I must be going. Stay safe, traveler. Seems like Huffman has something he really wants to say to you about the Dark Knight hero. To the Knights of Avonius and see if you can find him.
That doesn't sound very good. It's you two. Thank you for coming. So, the Dark Knight hero, do you have anything else you're able to share with me? Yes, of course I should fill you in first. Apologies for my appalling lapse of etiquette. The situation is... Mm. Here, take a look at this. Jeez, what horrible handwriting! Hmm... Let me take a closer look. Huh? Some parts of this seem to be complete gibberish. Hmm... <sighs> Indeed. Although this is written in the common tongue, it appears that a cipher has been used in many places. Nevertheless, one can grasp the general message from the non-ciphered portions alone. This is a war declaration from the Abyss Order to the Dark Knight Hero. Does that mean the bad guys want the Dark Knight Hero to go away forever and ever? <sighs> Something like that. Thus, we are hoping to contact him as soon as possible so that we can attempt to coordinate a response. After all, this matter no longer concerns merely the Dark Knight hero himself. It impacts the entire city of Mondstadt. If you find out anything at all, come and find me. sent by the Abyss Order. Oh, this is not good news at all for Master Diluc. Quick, we should go tell him right away!
Mr. D. Luke! Just now, we were at the Knights of Avonius, and... and... I take it you're about to inform me of the War Declaration from the Abyss Order. I'm aware of it. Though I appreciate you for taking the trouble to come all this way. What? The Dawn Winery's intelligence network extends beyond commercial matters. Great! So, what's the plan, Master Diluc? I'm open to suggestions. No. That would be playing right into the hands of the Abyss Order. They know full well that we don't exactly see eye to eye. They're using this as a means to force me into making an appearance. If my identity were exposed, all my future activities would be subject to some degree of interference from the Knights. After all, no powerful organization wishes to be outdone by someone from the outside. Woo! The Abyss Order has really dealt you a tough hand this time. What a sneaky little bunch those guys are! There is a way. But for it to work, I need some more information. Specifically, I need to decipher the obscured portions of the Abyss Order's War Declaration. Obscured portions? You mean the bits Paimon can't read? It must be a cipher only understood by members of the Abyss Order, used to spread messages within the organization. It's not simply a War Declaration, but also a notification to their own. When you take a stand that makes you a hero to one party, you also become a villain to the other. And since I've been the Abyss Order's enemy for so long, they've made me the target around which they can rally their troops and unite their strength. Wow! Seems like it takes a lot of brains to be a superhero, huh? I understand my enemy well, is all. As the saying goes, heroes and villains are two sides of the same coin. So what are we going to do about the intel that's written in gibberish, then? How do we... un... gibberish... fi... it? Simple. When you don't understand something, you ask. I've already tracked down one of their strongholds. If you're interested, feel free to come along. <laughs>